Hello everyone, I'm Blue. Welcome back to another video. There are two very important tips to stop counter attacks. The first tip is two rules about how to pick the formation that stops your opponent counter attacks automatically. These two rules are center backs plus one, full backs man to man. Center backs plus one means that your center backs must be more than your opponent strikers by one. So if your opponent is playing with one striker, it's okay to play with two center backs formation. And if your opponent is playing with two strikers, you should play with three center backs formation. And full backs man to man means that if your opponent wingers come back on defense, it's okay if you give your full backs join attack instructions. But also you should give them aggressive interceptions instructions. Because when your opponent starts his counter attack, the aggressive interceptions instructions will make your full backs mark opponent wingers instead of running back beside the line for no reason. And if your opponent wingers are staying forward and don't come back on defense, you should give your full backs instructions to stay back while attacking to keep his wingers marked. And always I give one midfielder stay back while attacking and aggressive interceptions instruction to intercept the opponent counter attack passes to forwards. The second tip is a manual tip to stop counter attacks. When your opponent starts his counter attack, the big mistake that most of you make is switching to any player of your center backs or full backs and starting to press the ball holder, which create big spaces for opponent forwards to run into. While all what you should do is to control one of your midfielders and press the ball holder from the back. While your last defensive line players will mark opponent forwards. So there are no spaces for them to run into. And even if opponent midfielders try to pass to them, it will be easy for your players to intercept the pass. And now, watch these defending situations. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well read to ease the pressure. And breaking at pace with Menace. Bit of a sloppy pass by Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Teammate available. And still trying to get the shot. Well, the post getting in the way there. And snuffing out the danger. On to Roberto Carlos. Oh, in with a chance. Oh, masterful defending to prevent what looked like a certain goal. Martins. An alert intervention. Kreif. And here's Ziyech. And the keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, nicely cut out. De Bruyne. Firing it in. And a goal to increase their advantage to us. Cuts it back. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. And the pass could do damage. And he read it well defensively. De Bruyne. Now, Kreif. Well, the attack promising as it was, scuppered there. But 
Scott McTominay. Chance to do damage. Take it away. Couldn't hang on to the ball. De Bruyne. Now Roberto Carlos. Scott McTominay. Ziesch. And now Kevin De Bruyne. Craig. Can they convert? Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Not a good pass. De Bruyne. Well, he likes to run at them. Oh, he's really up on the up here. And it's in! They're back in front! Mane. Can he take the chance? What an important piece of defending. Roberto Carlos in position to intercept. Just today, more importantly, can his team get a result? Salah. It's a perfect challenge. De Bruyne. 